my other son is my other Evan is his coach Joel. So this this here is another technique, okay? This technique here is the same technique we're working on, right? The only thing this is what I, I call my terminology. Listen to what I say. When I say my terminology, mostly is because I'm teaching you my way of thinking. My cement means little house in French. That's what it means, okay? When the French got took over Morocco, that lot of them had different names. This is one of the names that we inherited in my family, okay? So why I am teaching you this thing here is because this little house of mine has my own terminology. So if somebody comes out of nowhere and goes, oh, you learn from Kou Masonette? Oh, you know what I said to this and that? They, and they're giving you proper pronunciations of certain things and not my slang in it, they're full of shit, they never learn from me. You know my codes. My codes are my way of talking. My codes are mine. So if we go fight with another person, they don't understand what the fuck I'm saying. And I love that. You understand what I'm saying? So if I'm here, he slides it in. Push. See that? So now, how does it go? He throws a teeth there. He sees that he can slide in the closed space. Now he just swallowed this whole space on me. Now, this is the problem that we have now. Now he got his knees there. He got his elbows there. He got his other elbow there. He got his other knee there. He got everything there. You understand? And notice how he looks sexy. You know why? Because that's my son. So here we go, right? So that's how you gotta look. When you do things, we gotta look sexy, you heard? So he teeth me. Ursh, he slides it in. Ursh, now I move away, nice and lightly. There you go. See how he's closing space. This technique here is a technique that people don't really see. Come on, Safa. Now we're here. For instance, if I go here, he leans back. Ursh, he gives me that two, three. Ha ah, ah, gives me a knee. Ha ah, gives me an elbow. Ha. Ah. I come in. Look at his frame. See that? Why is he lifting this up? Because he wants options. If this elbow doesn't come, this happens. I try to stretch around. He's making it long. When I have this here, gives an opportunity for him to elbow with his hand, a knee. See, he's up. Being up is a difficult problem for most of us. We have a problem that after we go and throw ha ha, we throw a kick, we get flat and start going. Uh, Get it? So we're here. Up, 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 bump, you lift. Oh, now, look at his knee. Boom, the boom, look, boom, now, boom. Real simple. Keeps you up. You're following where I'm going. Yeah. So if he's up, he also can control. You get where I'm going? So what you're doing is you're doing what? Hence goes back to what? The frame. The frame is what? The upper torso. So, am I telling you to go like this? Move your head to the side. Look cute when you're punching. No, my nigga. I'm telling you, man your shit up. Get your grown on. Get your grown on. You understand what I'm saying? All right, I can't hear y'all. That's good. Let's go. Yeah. Push. That's right. Push. That's right. Huh? Push. There you go. See that distance? Come on now. Boom. See that? Yeah. Boom. 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 See that? Nice. Simple. Simple. Aggression, but also being saddled over. So what people say? Oh, he's very stiff. He's very one-dimensional. Then you get in there and you wind up in a problem and you're like, oh shit, I didn't know he was that strong. That's what Muay Thai is. A strong, but also flexible style. After a while, you make your feet learn. You learn how to become nice and trickery, nice and smooth, relaxing. Being able to make it look sexy. You get it? So at first, yeah, it looks lame, which is strong. Not chalat, which is not intelligent at first. But it is intelligent when you really stop and look at it. You got what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Pause.